Diva, come here, please. I have a concern. Oh, um, no, your natural deodorant isn't working. Stop, David. No, come here, sit. What? <clears throat> um. What? I just wanted to make sure that everything was okay between you and Patrick. Yeah, why, why, what did, what did he say to you? No, nothing, I just got scared when I saw your score on this relationship quiz. Oh my God! Because according to Milady Magazine, how electric is your relationship quiz from summer 1991, you and Patrick are in need of a generator, poor thing. Okay, first of all, it's Major Lady Magazine, and second of all, that quiz is garbage. Mmm, totally, David, this garbage quiz that it looks like you took more than once. Yeah, because it's rigged. You could take it a thousand times, you'd still get the same outcome. Oh, it's okay, David. You and Patrick have settled into that, like, nine to five life, so things are probably starting to feel a little snooze town. You're dating a vet who irons his polo shirts. Um, Ted and I got electrical storm, so. That's impossible. What did, what did you do to get that? Did you plug your hair dryer in with wet hands again? Okay, that happened twice, David. Let it go. Sorry that we work hard to keep the sparks flying. That's disgusting. We've actually started taking every Friday afternoon off to go on adventure dates. Adventure dates sound like something a marriage counselor would prescribe as a last resort. Okay, fine. I was gonna see if you guys wanted to join us this afternoon, but you probably have more exciting things to do, like putting price tags on things and... It's merchandising day, actually. Oh. Where are you going, anyway? Ted booked us a tour of Elm Falls Park, which is like a super cute look for us. Sounds dumb. Fine, text me the information and I'll see if we're interested. Oh, David, could be worse. You guys could be a total power failure. Mmm, eat glass. <laughs>